It sounds a bit cliche, but people, everybody has their own story, their own outlook on life. To be able to kind of create something with the universal appeal to bring a bit of light and a bit of happiness into people's wardrobes is really motivating. A hands-free setting on my hairdryer so I can multitask in the mornings. Varying people with tastes in food, music, art, culture, and I think in turn that is just always going to make this place incredibly creative and cultural. Internationally people see the Brits as outspoken, a bit of a creative flair, um, and the great British humour is kind of all about irony and sarcasm and for that reason I think people that are kind of stand out to me are people such as Banksy, Vivian Westwood, The Beatles, Rolling Stones and perhaps more recently Natalie Massonet who founded Nes Porte for kind of revolutionising the way people shop online. By changing my perspective, speaking to people outside of the field from what I do to get clearer ideas on things, recently discovered a UK street artist called Slinka Chu who makes tiny little miniature scenes in urban scenarios and photographs them with mini kind of figurines and I just think something's really moving about seeing your world in a totally different perspective. To be able to run a successful e-commerce site and fashion brand for my desert island deck chair, every other project in the meantime is just a small piece in the larger puzzle.